Hi, this is Jen Lasser with Adobe Analytics Product Management. In this video, I want to give you an overview of all the improvements we've made to our column settings over the last few months, including a new feature we're releasing today, which is the ability to wrap your column header text. So the first thing that I want to show you guys is the improvement we made um, when you adjust the, the, the row um, column. So as you pull this left and right, you'll notice that all the subsequent columns adjust um, in proportion to the changes that you're making. So um, this is something that we hadn't done in the past. In the past, if you would have pulled this out, you would have had to then go change each column one by one. Um, so we're hoping this is a huge time saver as you work with the, the layout and format of your tables. Another big time saving feature we put in is the ability to manage column settings um, across all your columns at once by holding shift and clicking start to finish the columns you want to include. Now when you click the gear here, any changes you make to the column settings will apply to the full table. So you can turn numbers off completely if percentages are going to tell your, your story in the data a bit better. You can choose to turn off percentages. Um, sometimes, you know, when you have a time dimension down your rows, the percentages don't always make sense, so you can simply turn them off like this. You can turn off anomalies, which will remove this um, uh, black triangle that's in your cells. So turning that off will remove that triangle as well as the expected line. Turning it on will put the line and the triangle back on there. You can now wrap your header text. So notice, you know, unique visitors and bounce rate are much more readable now, both in the digital format as well as when you print your PDFs. So hopefully that'll go a long way with making your dashboards more readable. You can also choose to interpret zeros as no values. So notice when I click this, all my zero values have blanked out. It makes the data table look a little bit cleaner. And finally, you can choose to turn the background off completely if you need to. The background uh, defaults to a green bar graph, can also be toggled to conditional formatting as well, or simply can be turned off altogether. So definitely take a look at these column settings the next time you're, you're formatting a data table to uh, in preparation to share with your end business users because um, there's a lot of great things that you can do in here to really clean up the tables and make them um, very readable and understandable for those end users that will be receiving it. Hope you guys enjoy some of these recent changes.